the video you're about to watch is ready to ask for space sausage. I be that breakfast. It ain't no joke. Young rapper, do it. Might just trap with you. Come in with the thunder, baby. Might just clap it. This video is sponsored by a tomato. Hey guys, what is going on? It's your main boy, Daddy D, here back again with the original GTA 5 content. Today we're talking about should you buy the new nightclubs with GTA 5 online? Are they worth it? Do you make some good money with it? Today we're gonna talk about that stuff because I bought the most expensive one ever, got all the upgrades, so now I'm gonna do a little review, you know. But before anything, guys, never drop a like and drop a subscribe for today's extremely fake giveaway. Today's extremely fake giveaway. Here this one out is 71 Megalodon shark cards. So if you guys want to drop in that extremely fake giveaway, you know what to do. Drop a like and drop a subscribe right about now. Also, never click that bell notification so you guys never miss an upload of yours truly also everybody i did click that little bell hey write in the comments below notifications quite i'll be sure to tell the shout out when you guys out my next video so shout out to my boy mason man so you might be asking yourself eh, should i buy these nightclubs in gta 5 line well yours truly bought it for the most expensive one with the most upgrades ever on earth so today i'm gonna do my little review on it how much money do can you make and all that stuff here it's a little complicated i'm still trying to figure everything out but it's it's, it's there you know? so the thing i noticed here when you go to your little you know club management you go to entry fee you can put it free i put it to 100 dollars because you know I, I didn't spend freaking eight million dollars in this game for nothing you know jumping my money back boy i've never seen that money back i'll be honest with you so once i did that i said no let me go upstairs so you can see i have ten thousand dollars on the bottom right now it's simple as this you can go to your little closet or the room come out of that closet boy you go in there click it bada boom bada bing you can get the ten thousand dollars i believe it goes to seventy thousand dollars total now you gotta keep your popularity up to get the ten thousand dollars every night i believe and eventually it's gonna get a cap for seventy thousand dollars once you get seventy thousand dollars you can walk right in and get a little thing right there bada boom bada bing seventy thousand dollars which is cool it's like a little passive income right there but it's it's not, it's not a lot of money. Seven days in GTA 5 line in the game, you get $70,000. So this one gets a little confusing for me as well, and probably maybe for you as well. I'm not really understanding this DLC so far, but anyways, say you've got your little bunker missions, you got your little freaking MC clubs around the town, you got your little like side businesses. You're gonna have these technicians that take a part of it and bring it to your freaking place, your goddamn little nightclub. And it's gonna be stored in one of these gay little closets you can see on the ground in your secret layer of your nightclub. It's tremendous, it's, it's, it's alright, it's alright. All right. Now you see my boy here trying to get on his MySpace account, so right here you have everything here we have a popularity up good tremendous got to keep your popularity up to get the ten thousand dollars every night so make sure you guys do that see a cap eventually seventy thousand dollars warehouse you gotta put these little technicians you're gonna have all this stuff over here so far i have twenty thousand dollars in the bank i can go sell this right now also a haggard part about that is though let's say i sell this for twenty thousand dollars for shits and giggles bada boom bada bing i think i'm gonna get twenty thousand dollars eventually no i'm gonna get eighteen thousand dollars because gay tony takes like two percent of it i don't know also i recommend doing your little bunker missions make sure you guys have a lot of freaking stock in your warehouses because it does take that stuff and bring it to your little freaking you know club place you see here got some technicians on stuff here i have freaking stuff in my bunker my mc place it's all good it's tremendous and eventually you see my popularity is going down uh -uh. i don't want that nine thousand dollars i want that extra thousand dollars so make sure you guys do the popularity missions as well in order to keep that ten thousand dollars right there and fresh and great grand wonderful for seven days in gta 5 align yeah so this is what I do when I do this little thing right here. I'm really new to all this stuff here in GTA 5 line. The DLC is new, so I'm trying to figure everything out. But this is what I do, my little side thing I do. I go on my little computer. I see how much money I have. And then my bunker's full. My freaking MC club businesses are full. So I got that good there. I got my technicians doing their things. It's good. This is what I do to get my businesses, you know, generate all the money and stuff. So they have all the stock and everything in there. My technicians are doing the work. I go to the freaking little freaking cameras. I'm in the public session by myself. If you guys do want to know how to get that, click on the card in the top right. And I'll show you guys how to do that for PS4 and Xbox One. Also. If you guys made it this far in the video, write in the comments below nuts and I'll freaking heart every one of those comments. So this is what I do, I just go AFK on my little camera here, I just make sure that, like my popularity goes up when it goes down, I start doing another popularity mission, so I have $10,000 a day it works. Then I go check my computer, see how much money I have in there, all my businesses are generating money to this here, they're taking some of it out, bada boom, bada bing, we Gucci. So for the conclusion, should you guys get a nightclub in GTA 5 online? Me, I'm on the fence, I'm like, I hey, do what the hell you want, I right, just do what the hell you want, do you think it's good? Do you think it's good? If you want to do it, go right ahead. Personally, I thought it'd be a lot better than this. I thought they'd do a lot more better missions and stuff like that. I kind of like the... Ah, maybe... I don't know, maybe in the future it'll get better, but right now it's just, it's not living up to the hype I thought it would be. So basically, I'll get this new DLC, basically a balls out of the ass. It's not tits to the mouth, but it's balls out of the ass. <laughs>